everyone, this is Retro Gamer JL78, 26 Tango Mike, and 2J40Z uh, back again. Now, I've just done a movie in a uh, video for YouTube in iMovie, and oh, okay, I'll get it here. So, we're going to go get info, and you'll see that the movie is 4.16 gig. That's it there. Now, what I'll show you how to do now is using one of these devices, I'll put a picture on the screen of it. This is an Elgato H264 Turbo device, and we're going to use that to bring the file size down. So I'm going to go and plug it in to my USB on my Mac. And we run the software. Okay, and all we simply do is drag our video into there, and it says Movie 2. Format iPod, and I'm going to do that one. Okay, and what the Turbo 264 device does is it takes all the work off the processor and makes encoding videos a lot faster. But the only issue is that Apple have removed um, export to QuickTime on iMovie 10 and above, which means you can't use it on iMovie anymore. iMovie 9, brilliant, work no problem with that one. Very quick exporting videos, iMovie 10 won't allow you to do it for some reason. So if Apple see this, get the quick time components put back into um, iMovie and Final Cut. And all I'll do now is press start. It's asked me to choose the destination. So I'm gonna stick it in the movies. I'm just gonna push open. And you'll see it's gonna uh, do these dots and eventually it will tell you how long it's gonna take. It's saying six minutes at current speed, 20 frames. A second that's what it's encoding that it won't play at that eight minutes so what do I leave it and once it's done I'll come back so I'll just pause this and I'll see you soon all right so it's done I've gone into the movie folder and as we previously saw the movie which was this one if I get the info that was 4.16 gig and that'll take a while to download on upload to the internet even on a fastball ban, that'd take a, I don't know, half hour if we went to save. But what I've done is I've reduced the file size with a H.264 device. So let's go and have a look at the file size now. So there's my new video that I've created. And if I right click and go get info, it's brought it down, right down to a more manageable 131.7 gigabytes. And the quality is still the same. So it's a hell of an improvement. It's just I export to iMovie on 1080p and just to make the quality just a bit better and it brings it out to 4.5 gig and now our Elgato Turbo 264 brings it right down and it was created at quarter past nine this morning started and 9.21 it finished so it didn't, didn't take too long long to do but unfortunately Apple have removed export to QuickTime on um, Final Cut 10 and uh, iMovie 10 which means you can't use these devices anymore on them, but you can use them on other things such as toast, burn, that sort of stuff. And it helps, really, really helps uh, encode Mac videos faster. And it's an essential purchase for the Mac. And mine was second used off eBay for about 30 quid. So all in all, not not a lot of money there. Right, I'll say seven threes and I'll catch you soon. This was just a quick video on bringing the file size down on iMovie. Cheers and beers.